Hey guys, what up? Jason here, and great news! Scribblenauts, uh, um, Scribblenauts, the Super Scribblenauts uh, trailer video I did was a complete and total success, meaning that uh, uh, we're going to be playing some Super Scribblenauts. Now, let's do level one. I remember all my training, all my Scribblenauts Jedi training, just a level start thing. Which is, uh, which, oh yeah, which is the real starlight, starlight, well, I think it's this one, because it's kind of glistening, so let's get a ladder, oh no, we, we, we already used a ladder, didn't we, um, pogo stick, let's use a pogo stick, let's use as many different crazy words as we can find this series, pogo stick, pogo stick, pogo stick, can I give it to, Ah. Oh. Yeah! I got it! Woo! Oh yeah! Bitch, I'm on a pogo stick. You ain't got nothing on this. Mm hmm. Boom! Oh, and we unlocked new levels! It's like a constellation! Ah! Oh, let's do level 2. Let's do level 2. Level start. Hmm. This is a giraffe. And a sea monster. Okay, I, I I don't get. I I know I know understand. I I know speak Americano. Right. Uh, can I get a, a hint? Both animals have a long distance between their what? Large flightless bird. Okay, fair enough. I can't. Okay, fair enough. Crane. Can I? Uh, have a crane for this one? Yes, let's use a crane. Bird. Oh, <laughs> vehicle. Okay, there we go. Boom! Okay, that's another story. We had to use two hints, but come on. Come on, guys. Come on, really. Um, let's do number three. Uh, let's do level three, yeah. Level start. Pit stop. The car needs replacement parts to get back on the track. Okay, what kind of parts? It looks like you could use a new engine. Pos yeah, a new engine. En Gin. Engine. There you go, mate. On your way, son. And I think I will take the star right. Yeah, that looks good. So basically, I'm like, kind of like, a uh, hero here. I guess I'm doing good deeds, basically. Like, uh, helping that guy out. Um, I feel kind of like Batman, but less, you know, you know, Super Saiyan Hardcore. You know, like, Super Vigilante. Uh, you know, less, less of that nonsense. You know, I, I can't be a vigilante. I'm, I'm, I'm a kid, for Christ's sake. Right, now I need to kick off this beach party, it said. So, what do I need? Apparently, I think I'll need several items. Uh, so we'll start it off with a DJ. Let's, let's get some, let's get some tunes in. Yeah, you, you know what to do. Crank the tunes! Okay, we've got some level progress, that's good. Um, music! Yeah, well, let's get some music in. Okay, oh, that, that actually got us the star right. Got DJ and some music. That's always good. It's a nice combination. Star right found! <laughs> um, let's go to level 5 then. I'm doing this in uh, new, uh, number order. Level star, okay. Help the stepbrothers become friends. They love their love of sports will bring them together. Okay. Well, I don't know. Okay, let's get let's, what was a good sport. Let's, let's get a cricket bat. Let's get a cricket bat. Don't say you want a bat that that plays cricket, please. Now the other brother needs the other brother needs something for some sport. Okay, cricket ball. 
cricket ball. There you go. A new word. And there we go. Yeah, go go off go off you two. Go go play sports or whatever. I am going to be a lazy bastard and play scribble noughts instead. Look at how like in video games they expect that there are actually people who are there are actually A siblings who are willing to play sports. Oh we didn't look anything. They, this game this game's by made by Nintendo. So in in Japan do are there actually people who go outside and play sports? Let alone siblings who want to play together? That's unheard of. That's flipping unheard of. I think we'll stick to this constellation for now. Right. Level starts. Oh, dinosaurs. Ah. Oh. Hint. Cause a new extinction event without weapons or asteroids. Damn it! Damn you and your lack of asteroids. What the disasters are there? There's forest fires. There's avalanches. Um. Tsunami might do it. Tsunami. Tsunami. Oh, jeez, I nearly drowned. Star I found. Oh, God, Maxwell nearly died. Jesus. Okay, let's go to number seven. Level start. Okay. And there's a <laughs> hey guys look. Look it's it's yo mama. <laughs> Alright, what well, when you come for each creature so do cow what do cows I guess a farm? Oh, one second. Sorry everyone, that was just... I think I'll edit that part out. <laughs> Me editing, yeah right. Um, so yeah, let's get a farm. Uh, yeah, that, that looks good. Okay, that's one done. This person, this person looks like he needs a... Let's give him a house. Because people live in a house. I mean, as simple as... Could give could have given him a specific type of house, but... Uh, uh, mate, your house is, uh, your house is causing me de de delay, so, there you go, um, can I just, <laughs> I've kind of toppled this house over, um, <laughs> yep, yeah, screw you, mate, <laughs> make way for Maxwell, motherfucker, <laughs> uh, how do I turn object, how do I rotate objects in, again, you'll just have to live with your, look <laughs> Oh no, what have I done? Okay, wait, if I knock it like, like this. Ah, there we go. <laughs> there you go, mate. Let's give this. I think for a tiger, it's simple as, you know, you need the zoo. Uh, yeah, simple as. Pretty, pretty straightforward. Um. Presuming it's not a wild tiger. I mean, if it's near a human being, it probably would have killed it. So, go presume it's uh, tame. You know. Let's just go to level eight. Well, uh, whoa! What's happened here? Has gone all lost in powers on us here. The boy throws. How did he? Is what I would like to be informed of. How did a human being? Was he in water or something? 
Because unless he was in like a perfect like square environment, then he would not have frozen the cube. Explain to me, madam, how this happened. No, just go, just go stand there. Oh, that's fine by me. I will save his ass. Radiator. Now I've watched a playthrough of uh, Scribble Knots Unlimited, and this basically caused the zombie apocalypse. Hopefully, it won't happen today. Let's pop it on his head. There you go, mate. There you go. Um, there we go. And I think we have time for level number... What, it, what number is it? Level number nine? Uh, possibly even ten. If, it, if ten is a thing. Level ten. Oh, God. The creator trying to use... Uh, some Help Maxwell make a body. That's fecking dark. This is Frankenstein up in this mother. Okay, um... A head, we can need a head to get a head in life. Uh huh. Uh, there we go. We're gonna need ears so you can listen to my amazing voice. <laughs> Phil. There we go. Did I just put my scythe in there? Fucking A. Um, we're gonna need eyes. Oh, I can to do some eyes of the bubble. Um, what else do we need? Um, could do with it could. Oh, but what do we need? We need hair. Hair. That's all the facial features. Can we get a chin? No, no, back, 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 back. Go back. I I spelled that wrong. Shin. Uh, no, no, I didn't want a cabin. I don't want a cabin. Thank, no, thank you. Um, we'll have legs then. Get some legs. Mm. That's a not really looks like a leg. Uh, we'll get some feet. Uh, let's get some arms. Don't worry, mate. No arm was done. <laughs> uh, let's get some hands. Oh, I want it, I want them to be jazz hands. Jazz. Ah. <laughs> Fine. Yeah, hands. We'll have hands. There we go. We created this tiny abomination of a human being. Right there. GG. Well, at least we got the star right. That's that's one thing. <laughs> Anyways, uh, so I think I'll leave it there for today, folks. Uh, I think we'll do level ten another time. But right now, I'm gonna leave you here for today, everyone. I hope you've enjoyed the video. I've enjoyed making it, and tomorrow, uh, or maybe some other day, we'll. Move on to another constellation. If you guys have any requests uh, for a shout out, you can do that uh, in the comment section below, and I'll do it on another one of my series called Jason City, which you can check out in the in the on my channel. I'll get in the link below, like I know how to do links. But uh, seriously, have a good one, everyone. I've been Jason, and you've been fantastic. Good day.